Hello everyone, my name is Yesha Rai Thatta and I am a CA final student from Mumbai. Today I am going to take up the topic moneyness of options uh, which is in paper 2 SFM. I specifically chose this topic because uh, the moneyness of an option is normally a part of the question which um, you know help us while reading the question and obviously if this small tiny uh, concept if we don't understand then we might not be able to interpret the question that well. So let's begin. Before we begin, uh, I want all of us to remember this one basic principle that everything in moneyness is based on the relation between the strike price and the current market price. So I think this makes it very obvious that in case there is a change in the strike price or the current market price or rather both, then there will be a change in the moneyness of an option as well. So with that, let's begin with our first topic that is moneyness with respect to call options. In this, there is in the money wherein the current market price is more than the strike price. Then we get to add the money where the current market price is equal to the strike price. Where and at the end we go to out of the money where the current market price is less than the strike price. So with that, uh, I know this sounds a bit confusing. So let's start by you know getting into a diagram. Let's just, let's just assume this is a circle wherein the periphery or the border is the current market price and then we have three strike prices for each of our situations. Uh, let's start with our current market price being 100 and one of our strike price being 80. In this case, if you observe, you will see that the current market price is more than the strike price. So in such a situation, this option would be called an in the money option. Uh, going further, if we take the st uh, strike price as 100, so you can also see that's why I've shown it on the periphery that is on the border of the circle. Here the current market price is equal to the strike price. So this is a clear case of add the money. And finally, if the strike price was 120, then uh, the uh, current market price is less than the strike price. So this is a clear case of out of the money. Now to again make more things clear for you all, I will like tell you that current market price is a ma market price which is prevailing right now in the market which goes on fluctua uh, fluctuating whereas strike price is the price at which we have uh, purchased the option or that is at which price we would want to exercise the option. Okay. Now going further, we will do with uh, moneyness with respect to put options. Before we get into this, I want you all to remember our basic principle that call and put are opposites of each other. So as you see, when if you remember our basics, call moves upward, whereas put moves downward. Due to this principle, they are opposite of each other. Now this is going to help us while even understanding the moneyness of put options. Again, there is in the money with respect to put options. Here, the current market price is less than the strike price. So, if you remember in call options, the current market price was more than the strike price. Correct. Now, if you go uh, into add the money with respect to put options, the current market price is equal to the strike price, which was the same in call options as well. And when you go to out of the money, the current market price is more than the strike price. Let's again see with help of the diagram. It's the same circle which we saw before with the current market price at the border of the circle and three strike prices. Okay, so first we start with a strike uh, current market price being 100 and a strike price being 120. Now here you can see that the current market price is less than the strike price. This is a clear case of in the money. Now if you remember in call options, the in the money situate was situated inside the circle. Whereas in put options, the in the money comes outside the circle. Because call and put ek dusre ka ulta hota hai. They are opposites of each other. Okay. Now we take a strike price as 100. Here you can see that the current market price is equal to the strike price. And as you can see, it uh, even the strike price is on the periphery with the current market price. So this is a clear case of add the money. Now it is the same uh, in both the cases that is call and put. Now we can go to the strike price as rupees 80. Here the current market price is more than the strike price. And this is a clear case of out of the money. Again, if you remember when it came to out of the money with respect to call options, that time it was outside the circle, but this time it is inside the circle. 
अगेन वाई बिकॉज कॉल और पुट एक दूसरे का उल्टा होता है दे ऑपोजिट ऑफ इच अदर ओके ओके गाइस सो नाउ दैट वी हैव लर्न्ड दैट मच लाइक और individually we have learned moneyness with respect to call options and put options let's try learning them together so here i here i have a comparison for of both of it moneyness of option we have three as you remember one is in the money then at the money and out of the money and these are a call and put options now with respect to in the money the call option in call option current market price is more than the strike price whereas in put it is less than the strike price in case of at the money it is same in both the cases and in case of out of the money uh, the current market price is less than the strike price whereas in put options it is more than the strike price so here we can observe that in uh, in the money and out of the money in case of call and put options the uh, strike prices and the relation of the strike price and the current price is different that is it is opposite of each other so guys i hope so far this has been fixated in your mind so let's go further about with this that is um in case of call options as you know the call works only up upside that is in case the current market price falls below the strike price then the call will lapse this situation of current market price being more than the strike price is seen in case of out of the money correct remember the strike price was outside the circle and that's why it was called out of the money now in such a case uh, you are bound to face a loss that will be exactly the amount of premium paid now as you know call is an option uh, call option is a right to purchase now if the current market price falls below the strike price and the option is lapsed but you have still paid a premium correct so that premium is going to be your loss however if there is a situation of in the money that is the current market price is more than the strike price then the call will be exercised now see the current market price being more than the strike price that is strike price is the amount at which we have the right to purchase the stock करेक्ट एंड इफ द करंट मार्केट प्राइस इंक्रीजेस मतलब जितना करंट मार्केट प्राइस ऊपर जाएगा उतना हमारा प्रॉफिट बढ़ते जाएगा सो इफ यू पुट इट इन प्रॉपर टर्म्स वी कैन से दैट आर प्रॉफिट इन दिस केस विल बी लिमिटलेस सो लेट्स लेट्स जस्ट समराइज दिस अगेन दैट इज इफ देयर इज अ कॉल ऑप्शन एंड देयर इज आउट ऑफ द मनी इन अ कॉल ऑप्शन देन यू आर बाउंड टू मेक अ लॉस हाउएवर इन केस ऑफ इन द मनी फॉर कॉल ऑप्शंस यू आर बाउंड टू मेक अ प्रॉफिट now let's see the same scenario with respect to put options now you know that put works downside that is if the current market price exceeds the strike price then the put will lapse this is the same situation of current market price being more than the strike price the same situation is seen in out of the money now if you remember i told you that put call ka ulta hota hai that's why iska out of the money करंट मार्केट वो सर्कल के अंदर था स्ट्राइक प्राइस भी सर्कल के अंदर था आउट ऑफ द मनी भी सर्कल के अंदर था सो द सेम थिंग रिपीट्स ओवर हियर अगेन दैट इज यू विल फेस अ लॉस व्हिच विल बी द अमाउंट ऑफ प्रीमियम पेड करेक्ट नाउ अगेन इन केस ऑफ इन द मनी विद रिस्पेक्ट टू पुट ऑप्शंस दैट इज द करंट मार्केट प्राइस इज बिलो द स्ट्राइक प्राइस द पुट विल बी एक्सरसाइज्ड current market price being below the strike price now strike price is the price at which we have the right to sell the stock correct to hamara selling price to fix ho chuka hai abhi current market price agar strike price se niche jayega that means we will buy at a lower price and sell at a higher price so due to this we are bound to again make a profit we can again say that this profit is limitless not exactly because gir gir ke bhi kitna zero tak ja sakta hai extreme case scenario so we can but still call it limitless so let's just remember this again in case of put option as well if there is an out of money option then you are bound to make a loss and in the money option you are bound to make a profit now someone will come and ask me ye to apne out the money and in the money ka bata diya at the money hua to hum kya karenge dono mein so basically the at the money for both is the same that is that time the current market price is equal to the strike price and when it comes to add the money the option will lapse lapse hoga to wapas wohi you will make a loss which will be the amount of premium paid so everyone i hope this video was a value addition to you either in terms of 
concept clarity or learning something new so firstly i would like to thank aryan sir for giving us such a great opportunity and would also like to request all of you to open heartedly share your feedback or your suggestions because at the end of the day i am also a student just like all of you all and i can always learn and improve so thank you and keep studying and bye bye